Hello, it's good to be with you, and we're broadcasting from what is a very special venue for all Australian football fans, Stadium Australia, here in Sydney. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And a really pivotal match to bring you, we're at the quarter-final stage of the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's Spain versus the Netherlands. Well, this has the makings of a very good game. Two sides full of quality, a great atmosphere, and everything to play for. A last four places up for grabs here. Here's the lineup for Spain. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. Here's the starting 11 for the Netherlands. Well, it's the same formation, but they use it to press the ball high up the field. And rarely do the wide players drop deep to defend. And watch out for the midfield three who continually rotate their positions. And they kick off here. Lika Martins. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Beautifully weighted ball. Can she put it away? What a big chance that was. Keeper has the ball. Van der Donk. Linet Berenstein. Committed challenge. Redondo. Ivana Andres. Tere Abeyera. Aitana Bonmati. Oh, it might be! And she's kept it out. Going for the short one. Shot attempted, and the keeper did more than enough. Played over. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Pelova. In with a chance. Oh, chance missed. Nil-nil it remains. Well, chances don't come much better than that. What a miss that is. Stain. A 
and pushed away to safety. With the game level, let's see what they can do with this corner. Good defending, clattered out of there. Well, it didn't really go according to the script, did it? Well, the less said about that, the better, because that's a really poor attempt in the end. And the keeper's given it away inexcusably. The mistake punished to the maximum, and the goalkeeper left distraught. Huge error. Well, here's the replay, and if you ask the goalkeeper to play up from the back, that's what can happen. It's a poor pass, it really is. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Well, she really deserves credit for that challenge. Well, no surprise there. Spain have had most of the possession, but it means nothing unless they start to be more creative, particularly in the wide areas. Up to this point, they've been too easy to defend against. Botellas. Here's Paredes. Mariona. Alexia Botellas. Well, she really had an awful lot on her plate. Massive credit goes to her. There was a lot of bravery involved in that as well. That's a really top class piece of goalkeeping. So, two minutes of stoppage time here. And now. Passing it through. Oh, big opportunity. And a goal to increase their advantage to two overall. That little bit of a cushion. Now it's all about keeping the concentration. Well, here it is again. And she's just been caught on the ball. That's a complete lack of awareness. It's a poor bit of play, really. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. And out of play for what will be a throw to the Netherlands. Kerstin Kasparay. And a timely intervention. Now options are plenty. Firing it towards goal. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Playing it short. It's wholehearted defending and the concession of a corner here.
Let's see about the delivery. The clearance wasn't decisive. And quite simply, wide of the target. And the flag does go up, must have been tight. Ivana. And Hermoso. Promising attack this. Is she going to score? And keeping it out. So a personnel change then. Over it comes. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. And they could get one back here. Oh, a superb save. Well, the keeper deserves a lot of credit. That was a fine save, wasn't it? Well, as spectacular as the save was, it can't be just about their stellar keeper. They know that. Oh, it could be. And still danger here. Well, it could have been, but for the offside flag. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Well, a successful intervention, winning the ball back. Oh, great attacking play. Can she score? Body in the way. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Wasteful from Spain. Oh, big chance! Well, she went for placement. A very disappointing effort. Well, what a wasted opportunity. They won't come much better than that. And time for the change now. Mariona. Well, good looking play with the ball of defeat. Well cleared away. Struggling to keep the ball. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. Could pull one back here. But no! What a glorious opportunity squandered to get back into this. Well, that had to go in, didn't it? I just can't see them turning this around now. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Just over, so near. Well, she'll have practiced that time and time again. It's fantastic technique. Just can't quite get it back down in time.
It must go in, surely. Well, after that mishap, the keeper can now exhale. The final whistle, and the Netherlands are through to the semi-finals. Yes, and thoroughly deserved, you have to say. Thought they controlled large parts of the game, they created enough chances, and if they can continue to replicate performances like this, they have to fancy their chances going forward.